from the entertainment capital of the world, Caesars Palace in Las Vegas, Nevada. It's the exciting new Prize Maximus Letter Perfect Game Show, Caesars Challenge. And now, ladies and gentlemen, Brandon Martin. Welcome to Caesars Challenge, a word game show where you can win a whole lot of money, including a brand new car. <laughs> and with that being said, though, and also before we get to introduce our contestants to this one, our champion, uh, Scott Seffy McVeigh, will not be able to get to be here on this one this week. But, however... You'll be here next taping on this one. That's the bad news. Good news, I will say, though, we'll get to crown ourselves a brand new interim champion on this episode. And with that being said, Jason yeah, Canio, you can you tell us our contestants in this one, please? Welcome in, gentlemen. And everyone knows. Yep. Good to have all you here, though. So, William, everyone knows you from being the co-host of the Popcorn Panel Podcast every Tuesday night at 8 p.m. Eastern, 7 Central, 5 p.m. Pacific here on the David 3000 Network, including... Yes, you would uh, be great. Yep, along with a main host in Victor the Valle, (laughs) which is Count Victor... Along with a Jordy Scout, aka J Man's legit, and occasionally Jared Ross. And yeah. yep, and basically, for those who don't know you on the network, and for those who don't know you well on the channel, tell us a little bit about yourself, real quick. Yes. Aside from me being a co-host of the Popcorn Panel Podcast, my name is William Braun, a.k.a. William the Conqueror. I am looking forward to playing Caesar's Palace, as I am a huge fan of movies, video games, TV shows, music, and all that stuff. And yeah, looking forward to uh, having a lot of fun here tonight. All right. And playing in the second position... We have Dante Pittman. Hello, hello. Yep, good to have you here, Dante. For those who don't know you, basically who are new to the channel, tell us a little bit about yourself real quick. All right, yes, I am Dante Pittman. I am 22 years old. I'm originally from Tallahassee, Florida, now residing in Eugene, Oregon. I'm an online content creator. been doing it for 10 years. Love doing it. And, of course... Of course, I am the owner and founder of Dante Pimmons Game Show Lounge on Discord. And, of course, I am ready to win some big money. All right. And playing in the third position, we have Jihad Plummer. Oh, Hello, everybody. Thank you. Yeah, good to have you here, Jihad. Been a long while, but is but still great to have you here on this this program. And for those who don't know you... Tell us also a little bit about yourself real quick. Shaha Plummer, I'm 25 years old, originally from Pennsylvania, now living in California, and I'm a content creator, and I've been doing so for over six years. Awesomeness. Well, best luck to you, John, and, and of course, best luck to everybody here on the program. And some people know how we play the game. For those who don't, I'm going to go over this rules real quick. So basically, we'll show a scrambled seven-letter word on a slot machine. One slot is in the word is designated as a lucky slot. If the letter is placed in the lucky slot, the player solves the word. And after placing the letter, you'll win the progressive jackpot, which we'll talk about the jackpot once we get there. And before they get to uh, guess, they will have you know go do a multiple to- choice toss toss up question. 
And the first player to buzz in has the opportunity to answer. If they are correct, you'll they'll earn $100 and the control of that word. And the player and if the player will select the letter in place of its correct position of the word. After, at, once the letter is placed, the player, the contestant will get five seconds to guess to solve the word. If they are correct, you'll receive $100 for each letter that is currently unclaimed. And if the lucky slot is placed and the word is solved on the same turn, you will see the jackpot along with the $100 that has been unclaimed. So basically, we'll be playing two seven-letter words that are in the first round. And we'll talk a little bit about round two and three once we get there. And it will be the same rules applied from there. And each word played also increases jackpot value. And the player with the highest score at the end of the game will win the game, keeps the cash, and moving on to the tournament, in which we'll explain about what the tournament is once we get there. And with that being said, we'll go ahead and get started, and we'll go ahead and send out the uh, scramble letter for the, on that slot machine. And with that, go ahead and send it on in. And we'll go ahead and show our lucky slot to the home audience. And with everybody, though, since we're not using any desk in this one, all three players are going to be going to use the saying the word just type in the word buzz and the first person to see that will get control of to guess on what that is and then they'll have again to control the word and with that here we go let's and get ready to get hands on your buzzers for this your first toss-up question goes something like this Yellow, green, or red? Which color is at the top of the rainbow arch? That's William. Red. Yes, that's correct. So you're on the board. Uh, William, go ahead and uh, pick a letter. Um, I'm going to say... O. The O, okay. O. Five seconds. That's time. Yep. I think. Syria, Jordan, or Kuwait? Which of these countries does not border Saudi Arabia? That's Dante. I'll say Jordan. Nope, that's incorrect. Anybody else? Jihad. Kuwait. Kuwait, you said? Yes. Nope, that's incorrect. Automatically, it's going to go to William. So, Syria is the right answer. So, William, again, go ahead and pick a, another letter. I'm going to say the D. The D, okay. Five seconds. Time. And we forgot to add the jackpot in, which is $500. That's out of the way now. All right. Helena, Albuquerque, or Lansing. Which of these U.S. cities is not a state capital? Dante. The first one. Helena. First answer. Yes. That's incorrect. Anybody else? Oh. Jihad. Oh, wow. Think, what are the other two options again? Either Albuquerque or Lansing. Lansing. Mm, no, I'm sorry. That's also incorrect. And again, automatically, goes to William. So Albuquerque is the correct answer. Wow. And with Dang that, it. I, I, uh, why didn't I go on my gut? I would know. Okay, I'm going to say... Go ahead. Let's go with the S. The S. Okay. Five seconds. Muhammad 
Muhammad mm-hmm. Ali, Benjamin Franklin, or William Shakespeare. Love all, trust a few, do wrong to none is a quote from... That's Dante. Mm, Benjamin Franklin? Mm, nope, that's incorrect. Oh, oh that's a uh, jihad. Shakespeare. William Shakespeare is correct. So you're on the board now. Mm. And Jihad, go ahead and pick a a letter. Or actually pick a letter, I meant to say, but yeah, go ahead. So what was that? What was that, Jihad? He said you. He said you. Okay. Oh, that's our lucky And with that, for five hundred dollars, what is it? He said outside. you get the $500 for the jackpot along with the $100 that is unclaimed $300 for you so a total of $800 and right now Jihad you are now up to $900 and with that we'll go ahead and reset and we'll go on to the uh, next uh, next scrambled word on this one slot machine do your thing again. Uh, I to make sure. Yeah, make sure I'm coming through. Okay, good, 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 good. All right, we'll show the lucky slot to the home audience on this one. All right. And with that, here is Jackpot Remains 500. And here is your next question there, players. Titanic, Citizen Kane, or Sean Shank Redemption? According to Votes IMDb members, the greatest movie of all time up to 2020 is. That's Dante. All right, I'll say Titanic. Mm, nope, that's incorrect. Saw so, uh, William again. I'm pretty sure it's the Shawshank Redemption. Shawshank Redemption is correct. You got it. Uh, yep. Yeah. Okay. Yep, yep, the 400, and, uh, William, pick a letter. Um, okay. Let's go with the A. Which A? Uh, the first A. The first one, okay. Five seconds. That's time. (sighs) Nothing. All right. Socrates, Aristotle, or Plato? Who created the academy in Athens famous for its philosophers? That's Dante. Socrates. Mm, Nope, that's incorrect. Anybody else? William. I'll take a random guess. Uh, Plato. Plato is correct. Oh! Wow. Okay. All right. And, uh, so I'm going to go with letter. the N. The N. Okay. All right. Five seconds. Oh, time. I know it. Helium, oxygen, or nitrogen? Our sun and most stars exist in a stable state of nuclear fusion, mainly converting hydrogen to which gas? And that's Dante. And I believe that is oxygen. Mm, nope, that's incorrect. Anybody no. else? No. Oh my goodness. Jihad? Nitrogen. Mm. No, that's also incorrect, and automatically it's going to go to William. 
Oh, uh, helium, helium, EOC. Ooh. And with that, I'm just gonna say I already know the word. And with that, I if you already know, please okay. come to yourself. And William, go ahead and pick a letter. The T. The T. Okay. Hundred dollars. What is the word? Oh, that's gonna be time. I can't think of it. So with that, jackpot's out of play. We go on to the next one. China, Japan, or Taiwan. The nearest country to South Korea is, of course, North Korea. What is the second nearest? That's Dante. China? Nope, that's incorrect. Oh Anybody goodness. else? Uh, William? Taiwan? Mm, no, I'm sorry, that's also incorrect. And automatically, he's going to go to Jihad, though. Japan. Ah. Oh. And with that, Jihad, go ahead and uh, pick a letter. C. The C. Okay. All right. Five seconds. Captain. Yes, that's been unclaimed that is three hundred dollars in this one and so far jihad you are now up to thirteen hundred dollars and that being said we're going to take our first commercial break and when we come back we'll go ahead and play the second round where it's going to be two letter two eight letter words with question per letter value increasing to two hundred dollars, and we'll do that right after this. So stay with us. There once was a town that worked so hard. There was just no time for play. But that all changed on this one particular day. Williams 600, Dante has yet to score, but hopefully you get some money in for the second round where this time question and per letter value increases to $200. And let's go ahead and send out our next word for this there slot machine. So with that, go ahead and do your thing once again. And we'll go ahead and show the lucky slot on this one. Jackpot now doubles to $1,000. And again, hands on your buzzers. And here is your next question. 80 kilometers, 350 kilometers, or 600 kilometers. Approximately how wide is the wet Red Sea at its widest point? Dante. Uh, 600 kilometers. Mm, nope, that's incorrect. Uh, anybody else? 
William. What were the other two choices again? 80 kilometers or 350 kilometers. I'm going to go with the 800. Uh, 800 is not an option on this one. So, uh, count that wrong. So, Jihad. Since 800 is uh, not e an option. So, is, is it 80 kilometers or 250 kilometers? Uh, 250. I did not say 250, but again, that's also wrong. Again? It sounded like you said 250. Well... It's three fifty. It's three hundred fifty kilometers. Actually, we were looking for. Oh. Yeah. But, anyways, we'll move on to a new question. Ohio, Illinois, or Vermont? Which of these U.S. states does not border one of the five Great Lakes? That's Dante. Okay, I'll go with the first choice. Ohio? Yes. Incorrect. Anybody ah. else? That's William. Vermont. Vermont is correct. <laughs> William? Go ahead and pick a letter. I'll go with the D. The D, okay. Five seconds. Time. It was a progress compared to the previous feudalist system. It was the single worst event in human history to him. He didn't think capitalism emerged, but that it had always been there. What did Marx think about the emergence of capitalism? That's Dante. Uh, I believe it was the worst thing in human history. Nope, that's incorrect. Anybody else? Unfortunately, I'm going to call time on that one. It was a progress compared to the previous feudalist system we were looking for. But again, we'll move on to a different uh, question. In highly advanced countries, everywhere in the world at once, in poor countries with oppressed populations. Where would socialist societies first emerge, according to Mar Marx? And that's Dante. All right. I'll go with the last choice. In poor countries with oppressed populations? Yes. That's incorrect. Oh my goodness. Anybody else? Oh, that's William. I'm going to go with the second choice. Everywhere in the world at once? Yeah. No, I'm sorry. That's also incorrect. Automatically, it's going to go to Jihad now. And it's in highly advanced countries. So you're up 1,500 and Jihad, pick a letter. No. The end, you said? Yes. Okay. Oh, wait a second. There's a little soft jackpot, though. And Jihad, for $1,000, what is it? Land mark. Yes, you got it. $200 that has been unclaimed. 
So total of this one with $2,200. And so far, Jihad, you are now up to $3,700. All right, and we'll go on to the next word. And with that, slot machine, again, send it on in. And we'll show the lucky slot machine to the home audience. And jackpot now resets at $500. All right, here we go. Here comes your next question there, players. Hands on your buzzers again. Sex, religion, or sports? Famous quote, blank is the opioid of the people. And that's Dante. I believe that's religion. Welcome to the game, Dante. You're on the board. Thank you. Jesus. Thank you. All right, let's hey, take good it Good job. Thank you. Woo. Let's start with the first aid, please. The first aid, okay. <laughs> Five seconds. Attacker. You got it. Nice. Very nice. Very nice. Very nice. Very nice. Very nice. That has been unclaimed. That is $1,400 for you. And so far now, Very you're good. in second place now at $1,600. All right. And with that being said, we'll take another commercial break, and when we come back, we'll be playing round three, which will be two nine-letter words are going to be played with question and per letter value will increase to $300, and we'll go to round three right after this break. So stay with us there, won't you? I'm finally on the board. Thank you. Nice job, Dante. Wait a second. I'm done. Dante, I was about to say, maybe this is not your day. Yes, yeah, sir. Not too close. What do you think? I got that insurance? What insurance is that, Yogi? The one you really need to have. If you don't have it, that's why you need it. Need what? I fly. Well, if you get hurt and miss work, it won't hurt to miss work. And they give you cash, which is just as good as money. Aflac, ask about it at work. And we welcome you back again for Caesar's Challenge. So far in this one, Jahad now has 3,700. Dante finally on the board with 1,600. William, in that case, <laughs> it's at 800, though. Now, <laughs> in this case, this is now two nine-letter words with question per letter value will increase to $300. So it can be anybody's game on this one. And with that being said, slot machine, go ahead and send on the word. All right, let's show a lucky slot to the audience in this one. And this time the jackpot now doubles to $1,000. And here is your next question on this one, players. Hands on the buzzers. He had died long before, before it, but Lenin cited him as an influence. He was one of its leaders, but was assassinated after Stalin's takeover. Or he remained in Western Europe and had little to do with it. What was Marx's, Marx's role in the Russia Revolution? And that's Dante, so I'm first. I believe he was assassinated when Stalin took over. Nope, that's incorrect. And William. Uh the I'm sorry, uh say that again there, William. I said, uh, the, is it the second choice? Actually, Dante already chose the second choice, but you would have been wrong as well. Oh. 
Jihad, either the first or the second one. Yes, the first one. He had died long before, but Lennon cited him as an influence. Yeah. That is correct. You are now Ooh. up to an even $4,000, and Jihad, pick a letter. Bah. The M you said? Yes. Okay. All right. Five seconds. Former. Yes. Got it. Yeah. <laughs> All right. That is basically in this one, three hundred dollars that has been unclaimed. So you got eight of them unclaimed. So that is a total of twenty four hundred dollars. And right now, wow. Jihad, you are now up to six thousand four hundred dollars. <laughs> wow. Wow. All right. And we'll go ahead and reset that one, and we'll go on to our next word right now. We'll show a lucky slot to the home audience. This time, Jackpot is now up to $1,500. All right, and here is your next question on this one, players. Only that which we can feel with our senses is real. Individuals are shaped by the material world, i.e. society, or only material success is important in one's life. Marx was a materialist. What was the point of materialism? Oh, and I saw... Uh, Dante first. All right. I'll say the second choice. And yes, that is the correct answer. <laughs> All right. Oh, you are up to 1900. And uh, Dante, go ahead and uh, pick a letter. Uh, the second P, please. The second P. Okay. All right. Five seconds. Wallpaper. Yes, that's right. That, so that $100 has been unclaimed. That is going to be $2,400. But, unfortunately, that is not going to be enough. Ah! As Jihad, you are now the interim champion. Oh, Good game. Well done. Good, good game. game. Yes, it was a good game on that one. We'll talk to you, Jihad, in a moment. Well, William, at least you're going home with some money though, <laughs> with you. But did you still have a good time, though? Yep. I still had a great time as well. Yep. Thank you very much for having me on. Yeah, you're welcome. With that, $800 for you and some nice consolation prizes backstage. And Dante, you didn't do too bad for yourself on this one. Made yeah. a comeback fine as you made a finally you were on the board though, and then came up just short, but did you still have a good time though? I did, I did. Thanks for having me on. Yeah, you're welcome. And with that, forty three hundred dollars and some also some nice consolation prizes as well. And when we come back, can Jihad Plumber win a car? You're going to have to wait and find out as we'll do that right after this. So stay with us, won't you? What a game. Good game, both of you. Good game indeed. Yeah, thanks. Plummer is our brand new interim champion. $6,400, and he has a chance to play our bonus round. 
as he gets a chance to play for a brand new car since last week we did give away a car finally after three attempts and did it well. Now we put in a brand new car in this one. So with that being said, so, so Jason, can you tell us what that car is going to be for this, for this week? The 718 Cayman by Porsche comes with all the standard features including 6-speed manual transmission, power steering, 14.3 gallon fuel tank, 2.0 liter turbocharged boxer 4 engine, sports exhaust system with central oval brush stainless steel tailpipe. Also, you've got the Porsche Communications Man Management Inc. Plus Sound Package Plus, Apple CarPlay, and a 3-month Platinum Plan Trial subscription to Cirrus XM. All told, this is a prize worth $69,950. All right. Jihad, you are playing for nearly close to a $70,000 car is currently at stake. And it's very huge if you do get this and you win a car and you do get to come back as an interim champion. And with that being said... Let's go ahead and start the tournament on this one. So with that being said, let's start it off right now. I only see the word final right now. Am I coming through okay? Oh, never mind. I see it. The words. Okay, I see. It, it, it changed. Yep, and with that, Caesar says stop and picked us a nine letter word. And with that being said, let's go ahead and. Uh, Showcase the scramble word that they just randomly uh, randomized for us. And with that, let's put it up on the board now. All right, Jod, since it's your first day as the interim champion, you have one letter to pick. So with that, go ahead and pick that one letter. This, the first H. The first H. Okay. All right. Here we go. You have ten seconds. Talk out. Talk the puzzle out, and go ahead and good luck. <laughs> No, uh, son, no, um, um, uh, uh, I'm drawing a complete blank here, uh, uh, uh I don't know. Mm -mm. Oh, man. Oh, unfortunately, that's time. Does everybody know what that word is? Everybody looks stumped on this one. Well, all right, let's go ahead and show the uh, word on this one. Duction. Duction, we were looking for. And yes, it's basically is in this one. Duction. Duction is a dog of a short leg, long body breed in this one. That is, what is, that is Duction. On that one. Unfortunately, no car for you in this one, but that's the bad news. Good news, I will tell you, though, Jihad, you still got $6,400, and you get to come back on the next episode to defend the England Championship. If you do get to come back for this, we'll be playing, you'll be playing, you'll be put, putting two letters in this one for that nine-letter word. 
However, this we're out of time for right now, though. And thank you guys so much for watching the Caesar Challenge Season 1, Episode number 5. And if you like this, please go and give this a thumbs up. And please like this video, leave a comment, and if you're brand new to the David 3000 Network, make sure to subscribe, and also not forget to tap that notification bell under the David 3000 Network on your YouTube app so you'll never miss an upload or a live stream. And once we do give away the car once again, I'm Brennan Martin saying thank you very much for watching, and we'll see you next time for another exciting episode of Caesar's Challenge. Take care. Bye for now. Some of our contestants will receive Bistol's Double Action Floor Sweeper. Snaps up dirt and litter off carpets and bare floors. Great for quick pickups between vacuumings. Furnished by Bistol and 20 Mule Team Borax. A natural for cleaning and refreshing all the family wash. 20 Mule Team Borax. And a member of our studio audience will receive the Vitamix 3600. A stainless steel three-minute bread maker and home yogurt factory. It juices without waste, cooks without burning, freezes instant ice cream, and offers 800 hundred great recipes. This is Jason Canio speaking for Caesar's Challenge. Don't forget to subscribe to the Gary Thousand Network for more great content like this one.